1989. I ain't get serious about it till 95 though. When I got out the joint. I was like, fuck this place. I'm not coming back. So I gotta think of something else to do, motherfucker. And I got it cracking. Man. That's some shit. You get serious about some shit, it's gonna crack, trust me. I ain't never been gonna make the motherfuckers come out back to back like that. My first one in 95 was called From Death. Uh, me and Proof was in the Goon Squad then. Uh, and um, then like in 97, I released an album called G For Life, 98, a click boom compilation then. I ain't dropped nothing else till I dropped a Who Wanted CD in like 2000. And then uh, they released a back album in 2004, 2003. And then the People vs. came out in 2006. <laughs> then I just dropped The Villain in 08. Took it back from the label. Now it's coming out this summer as the bad guy. Took some changes and shit, so. Uh, the bad guy, I'm gonna release it in the, the end of summer. So I'm gonna let him go ahead and do what he's doing, you know what I'm saying? Not try to cross promote with his album, you know, not not saying that I, I'll sell him or nothing because fuck it, no. Nobody can. Uh, he Eminem, Emma motherfucking Nim. He gonna sell more than anybody again. And uh, then when, you know, once his sales, you know, start taking their toll and do the max, then shit, I'm gonna drop my shit again. Cause he coming out next month in May, so I'll probably come out in August, late August, early September, some shit like that. Hell yeah. I fuck with the little nigga, even though he owed me $40. <laughs> Yo, Mitch cool, motherfucker, so Come on up, they cool as hell This one is four, four, y'all God damn, y'all be in there cracking Y'all empty that equipment out that club so damn fast I ain't never seen no shit like that in my motherfucking life <laughs> I like working with uh, Mike Bellucci, my little homie you know, but you know, when it get late, might get a little, you know, his pants get tight, you know what I'm saying? They get to, okay, we just, well, we just wanna, come on, we, we just wanna get this done. Motherfucker, we waiting on you. <laughs> so, uh, and then he'll start slacking a little bit and not setting up the lights properly and just, let's just shoot it type shit, so. Um, David Duhamel was cool, I like working with him. I don't like his uh, producer though. I want to hit that bitch in her face. Um, I work with who the nigga that did uh, Let It Fly. Uh, I don't fuck with that nigga though. He don't. I don't really fuck. With him. I don't like his propane. No, propane did uh, Let's Work with Me. I did Let's Work myself. Propane helped me on that. Um, can't think of the nigga name that did. Uh, let it fly. He was a nigga out of Chicago. Somebody that the label Koch had found. So I won't be fucking with him no more because it's easy to do this shit, you know, when you know what you're doing, you know what you're looking for, you know what you're going after. It's just like, you know, light it, point it, shoot it. You know what I'm saying? As long as the energy is all the same in the room between the director, the DP, you know, the uh, grips and all that shit and everybody that's on the set, shit go perfect. You know what I'm saying? So. So, I can't think of that nigga name to save my life. I still keep thinking. Probably because I ain't gonna work with him no more. Whatever the fuck it is. <laughs> nigga shot a video with me and Ice Cube and he just had it looking retarded as hell. I'm like, man, what the fuck is this? So, I sent that video back 14 times. Like, this some bullshit. Sent it back again. Bullshit. 
then it got to the point where the album was coming around. I was like, all right, man, this shit, it's all right. Let's just go. Fuck it. Come on. Well, MTV, you know, pulled my video the day it came out because they put it on the, in the same day they yanked it because uh, this uh, stupid ass reporter misquoted me and uh, I offended the gay people at MTV. And it was not intentional. I didn't mean, I didn't say it like the bitch wrote it. I wasn't trying to offend the homosexuals. But fuck it, you know, they pulled the video, it's all good. Because shit, you got this is 50.com, World Star, YouTube, all these other bullshit websites, you know, you put your shit up on. And my favorite video shows anyway, pretty much, is the hood video shows, the, uh, the you know, the local video shows, because they get it in. And that's the real shit. That's shit. everybody in every city watch that shit. MTV is kind of overrated, you know, so is BET, so, you know, they think if you ain't on BET or MTV, then you ain't, you know, top flight, but that's a crock of shit, fuck that. We going downstairs. <laughs> 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 Yeah, I do want to let y'all ho ass niggas know all this bullshit y'all talking about trick trick ain't even happening. So y'all need to just squash that bullshit before y'all run into big dog blood. <laughs> <laughs> bitch. Bitch. Yeah, bitch. <laughs>